The Vivo S7 5G is now official with a Snapdragon 765G chipset, 64MP rear and 44MP front cameras. Those aren't the only cams on the phone, in fact photography and video capture are its forte. But let's start with the 6.44 AMOLED display. It has a 1080x 2400px resolution 20 to 9 and it boasts HDR support along with 98.5% NTSC color coverage. The refresh rate is standard 60Hz, however, there are fingerprint reader built into the display. Notched into the display are two cameras. The main shooter has a 44MP sensor and an autofocus lens with f/2.0 aperture. It's capable of recording 4K video at 60fps. Next to it is a 105 ultra wide angle camera with an 8MP sensor. Around the back we find the main 64MP camera like the front cams. This one supports electronic video stabilization plus the latest Super Night modes from Vivo. You can shoot video with the front and rear cameras simultaneously split screen. Next up is the 8MP ultra wide camera on the rear, which also doubles as a macro cam. Finally, there are 2MP depth sensor. For zooming, the phone relies on the high resolution main sensor. The Vivo S7 is powered by the Snapdragon 765G chipset. Paired with 8GB of RAM LPDDR4X, dual channel. The base storage is 128GB but you can get 256GB instead both UFS 2.1. There no place for a micro SD card on the dual SIM slot. The 4000 mAh battery supports 33W flash charging with the 11V per 3A charger that is bundled in the box. There are no 3.5mm headphone jack. But Hi-Res audio is supported if you use a USB-C headset. Wireless connectivity is pretty solid thanks to the Snapdragon chipset. 5G SOC NSA, of course, plus dual band Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 5.1 with aptX HD and LDAC, plus NFC. The S7 is available in three colors, the most interesting of which is the Monet option. Layers of blue and purple mix in a way inspired by the Impressionist painter. The phone is thin and fairly light. Measuring 7.39 mm and weighing 170 G note, the Monet color is a tenth of a millimeter thicker. The Vivo S7 can be pre-ordered in China today. The first units will ship on August 8th. The 128GB model will cost you 2,800 Chinese yuan $400 slash 40, while the 256GB one is 3,100 Chinese yuan and will ship later on.